what up ladies welcome back to my channel very vanessa in today's video i want to show you exactly how i prepare and perform my my castor oil packs now the castor oil packs you can do up to three times a week as needed except for when you're on your period and when you are pregnant make sure that um you double check on that because that's really really important number one you don't want to do it while you're on your period because it is going to make your period come out heavier okay and number two you don't want to do it when you're pregnant because it does cause contraction of your uterus and that could produce a miscarriage so please make sure that you are not pregnant make sure that you are not currently on your period so you do want to start off with a wool flannel cloth. I pre-cut mine so that it could fit the size of my abdomen. And you do want it to fit just like so, right over your abdomen. Next, you'll want to place your wool flannel cloth into a pot with some castor oil and let it really sit and saturate. You can add more if necessary. I'm just going to use my tongs to flip it over, maneuver it, and make sure that both sides are saturated with the castor oil. Now it's ready to go inside of the oven. I preheated my oven to 400 degrees and I'm gonna let that sit for five minutes. After five minutes, you wanna take it out of the oven and let it cool off a little bit. You don't wanna put this directly on your skin because it's too hot, so just let it cool off. In the meantime, you can set up your bed with a towel so that you don't make a huge mess. You also wanna wear some clothes that you don't necessarily care about, so I'm wearing my workout clothes. Now, after it's cooled off, you can put your castor oil pack on your stomach with a plastic bag over, over it so that you don't ruin your heating pad. Put your heating pad on high and let that sit for 30 minutes. You can read a book, you can take a nap, just let it absorb and do what it's supposed to do. After 30 minutes, you can take the castor oil pack off and this is how my stomach looks. You can actually store it in a mason jar, like a glass jar or in a plastic bag and just put it in your refrigerator until your next use. But that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.